everybody, we are playing games, and we're not playing Bioshock Infinite because I suck at it. Also because it's not two-player, and Ryan is here. You can Hi, see everybody. Next to me. Ryan, also, you are you are currently on my left. I am holding up my right hand because I wasn't sure which side you were actually on. Okay, I, I have... Uh, some... I can see Ryan, but he can't see me. Yeah, so I have no view into what Jim is doing. It's I kind of exciting. flipping me off and dancing around with no pants. Wouldn't you like to know if I'm wearing pants? Yeah, we we're going to play Divinity Original Sin. We played a little bit of it uh, a couple nights ago, and it was fun. And it seemed like a fun game to let's play. And we are hopefully not terrible at it. D does that not make a more entertaining let's play? Actually, no. I mean, I'm pretty bad at Bioshock, so maybe. Anyway, I am... I ca yeah, I kind of want to be a cleric. Alright. Uh... Which gives me a heal. Um, some kind of... Cone... Blasty thing. Alright, I, I think I'm and going the to be melee a enchanter. Stance. Uh... Now, am I going to be... Uh, are you going to be a lady person or a man person? I don't know. I was, I was sort of digging the no pants thing that was going on yesterday. I'm not a, I'm not a big fan of pants. Do we want to be team no pants? We could be team no pants Sweet. And, and be team, two lady people. Team but I feel no like pants. we should explore the depth uh, of the uh, 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 of the divergent sexes in this. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm, I am currently attempting to customize my abilities. Um, All right. Um... Well, I'm going to customize my underpants, because that seems important. Ooh. No one can see it. They're looking at me, looking at abilities. But, All right. Um, well, we'll, they, they we'll get a special surprise. When you customize your underpants, that, that there are three exciting options. Uh, but I will also customize my abilities. Huh. All the cleric abilities are in the... Uh, I can get encourage... I can at, at, encourage allies around me. That that sounds very nice of you. Um, I don't know what that means. Uh, what are my skills? All right. Okay, so you you're grabbing the co the heal, right? Yeah, I've got the minor heal. All right, so we don't both need that at this point, right? No, I don't think All so. Right. So I'm going to get the dropping people out of the sky, because why wouldn't I? Yeah. Um, I kind of want to get rid of Divine Light. It decreases people's bodybuilding and willpower by two. And take um, Encourage or something, like something that buffs allies. I like that. I like I like sort of having a, a cheerleader on the team. Somebody to tell me that my failures aren't as, as bad as they could be. Mm -hmm. Sort of a life coach. Yep. That's me. Fantasy Deepak Chopra. In fact, what are my skills? Hydrosophist and Man-at-Arms. Oh, right, because skill points unlock... The thingies, yes. The skill points unlock the ability to learn to learn the thingies. So if I if I like pull out one of my my skill points, um, I will lose all the powers associated with that. Yes, which is uh, I think I'm. Uh... Ooh, I'm gonna see what we've got under pyrokinetic. That sounds exciting. Uh, because I kind of want to get leadership, but. I uh, I will go without it for now. Apparently, there's a crafting system in this game too. Oh man, this seems like a game with a lot of depth. I am excited because like, like we literally only played for what an hour. Yeah, and and half of that was picking our hairstyle. Yeah, hairstyles are important, which reminds me, I should get on that. Um. I'm a lady. 
all of my uh, profile pictures are weird. A whetstone. Quite useful for a war-weary blade. A whetstone. Quite useful for a war-weary blade. Careful now, that's a trap. So my voices come in American and two varying shades of British. Hold, our enemies have lain a trap. I am also probably going to um, turn the volume down a little bit. We didn't actually do a test recording on account of. Oh wow, that's cool. On account of. So we have, we have night. we have no idea if this stuff is actually audible. Well, we'll figure it out. I'm confident. Uh, so yeah, do I want to set people on fire? You like or, uh, do more damage and make them warm. Ooh, I can wear a little circlet thingy. Also, I don't know why you would want to set people on fire. Well, well, like, making things warm can set things on fire, too. Apparently, there's, like, two levels. If you're warm, then you're more flammable. That makes absolutely no sense. Oh, now we got a plan. Now we got a plan! Yeah, all right. I don't. I still can't see you, so I'm just bashing that's so, my own. That's okay. It's going to be great. Hair color is spiced ale. Ooh, that sounds nice. Mm, do I want to be blonde? I like how every one of these colors has a has like a weird name. It's not just brown. No, we don't want it. We won't be blonde. All right, now I'm gonna. Now I get to the underwear customization phase. It is weird to me that like underwear customization is a thing in this game. It I assume at some point it's terribly important. I guess like we're gonna there's gonna be a competition. Yeah, they're um, gonna be like, well, I mean, did you pick the bikini panties or or like this uh, this sort of? No, no, I'm 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 called? rocking the boy shorts. All right. Uh, they yeah. sound more comfortable, honestly. They, yeah, they, look... they really, they really do. There we go. Your name is Roderick. That seems a terrible name for your your young lady. Scarlet, yes. Scarlet really doesn't fit the picture that I'm painting here. What is my name? What's my personality like? Right, well, it tells you a little bit. You pick your class and go read the uh, little blurb it gives you in the middle. Some of them are really depressing. The seven gods may be almighty, but they hardly expect to fight their own wars. Thus, an order of ascetics devoted to the seven gods and practiced in the arts of war and healing carries out the will of the, div the divine. These men and women are t trained to transform a Spartan diet of crickets and snow into the raw strength necessary to turn the tide in any holy war. They restore and regenerate their allies as thoroughly as they annihilate their foes. Enemies of source and all unrighteous magic, clerics are the cleansing hand of the gods made manifest. Oh dear. For centuries, clerics have worked alongside the Order of the Source Hunters to purify the land of evil magic. That sounds nice, except for the diet. Yeah, crickets and snow. You, you know there are other things you could eat. Nope, crickets and snow, man. <laughs> what, if, gotta, what, gotta, what if it's warm outside? Doesn't matter. Well, then it's just crickets. So really, it's crickets or snow, because in the winter, not a lot of crickets. Yep. That's why you got to store up your snow for the spring and store up your crickets for the winter. Uh, all right, so I think I'm going to be a teleporting, fire-throwing lady. Okay, I am a sword-hitting, uh, gently encouraging lady. Ah. Oh. The, uh... It's not terribly fantasy. 
But I kind of want the the enemies of Source and evil spellcasters to fear the wrath of Susan. <laughs> oh, I could be Bill. <laughs> Bill and Susan. I mean, my oh. boss calls me William, but everybody else, you know, it's just Bill. Mm. That's the best part about these games, is like the first 20 minutes are always character creation. Well, I'm sitting here picking between another fire spell or head butts. And I can, I can crush people's heads and possibly that sounds blind awesome. them. sounds awesome. Or I could light them on fire more. There we go. Perfect. All right, I am excited to see what you have created. I think, yeah, I, I oh no, no, I need to, I just, I need to, uh, I need both my fire spells. All right. It is glorious. I think that I have started a naming convention that you should adopt. Oh, I'm terrified. All right, but first my, my beautiful, okay, I'll come out. Oh, oh man. Oh, what has happened? You do not look healthy. <laughs> I didn't realize you hadn't seen it yet. No, I was in my own customization screen. What? Well, I understand that your diet is crickets and snow. It's not good for your complexion, okay? But it's good wow. for the mighty and the div the divine power. You need anyway, some iron in your diet. Join my divine order of sailor scouts. <laughs> Working on it. Um, sailor Roderick, you are called by the divine. So, uh, I guess I guess that means I'm a lady person. Uh, which, which voice did you choose so that I, I might? Oh yeah, I don't even remember. Um, I've got wizard voice. Look out! I see a trap nearby. Hold. Our enemy. What could that have done? All right, I guess it'll be a rogue voice. Quite useful. Um, what can I cook up today? Oh yes, and my beautiful uh, summary. I'm an enchanter. Orcs. Yes. Puppets, creatures of the void, dolls. For the enchanter, enemies are mere toys. And battle is equal parts play and experimentation. Raised by dedicated natural philosophers like Newton. The enchanter grew up believing that less desirable races were profoundly important. A living orc could be experimented upon in ways one would never dream of applying to a human you may notice my character inching toward the edge of the platform away from you <laughs> trained to assist in capturing and controlling these test subjects the enchanter's expertise is unparalleled what those natural philosophers didn't expect however was their well-trained enchanter to realize that they were horrible people oh well that's a... and the horror of their experiments and to turn that expertise against them I guess the we can be friends hunters, then. Who pulled them down from the spikes upon which they'd been compelled to impale themselves offered the enchanter a choice. Rot in jail? That seems rather charitable for the fact that I just murdered a bunch of people. Um, or turn those powers of manipulation towards the greater good. To be fair, those people were basically wizard Nazis. It's true, they were wizard Nazis, and I was for a while a wizard Nazi. But you're um, like a good wizard Nazi. Yeah, as it, I'm like, you know, yeah, have you seen that Mitchell and Webb Web sketch where they're like the Nazis and one of them goes, hey, hey, Carl, yeah. are we the baddies? Yes, yes, I am. It's like, what, why do, <laughs> they've got why do you ask? Uni uniforms have skulls on them. <laughs> oh. oh, man. Right. Yeah, that's that, that's a thing. You are you are still in, in, in regardless of of gender or past war crimes. You are invited to the divine order of sailor scouts, and you we have an all you can eat buffet of crickets and snow. That that's wonderful. I am. I, I suspect I will not join you in the crickets and snow, as uh, I think. Well, there, there's still a lot of customization for me to do here. Um, that's probably about as close as I'm going to get. Uh, Seems like you have it. something specific going on here. 
Yep. All right. I'm going to pick the Vault 13 uh, Star Spangled Underpants. Oh. Where's my hair? Ooh, not an afro. That's no. Nope. Not, nope. not going oh, with oh the mo goodness. either. The bowl cut. Uh, there is there is a lot of exciting hair. Yeah, I know. We're watching you change through it. Oh man! Oh, the flat top. No, 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 no. Now I want to do a kid and play. Let's <laughs> let's play. There we go. That okay? I think that's probably oh, about man. as anime as this guy's gonna get. Are you just like straight Tetsuo? Well, I mean, like you did kind of Tetsuo all over those enchanters. <laughs> Ooh, uh, no, no, no. Um, all right, uh, a good. You should totally be Sailor Tetsuo. I'm... Gosh. You're miss you're missing the whole thing that's going on here. I am. Um, it's I'm just trying to think of an appropriate garment. Oh, uh Are you the tuxedo mask to my sailor? There we go. Doublet mask. Nice. Doublet mask and Sailor Susan. What is wrong oh. with us? Uh because if you'd been the list is lengthy. If you'd been Sailor Tetsuo, I would have changed to Sailor Kaneda. Oh, dear. All right, I'm going to hit accept. Uh, yeah, yeah, I think I'm done. And it begins. In the days of old, the sorcerers of Rivalon cured the Look at how we spell source with a U. Through a great power called That is source. not how you spell source in Canada. Or but a terrible Canada. darkness invaded the land, and source was forever tainted. The sorcerers who once healed now only destroy, and madness has overtaken them. A few brave source hunters are all that stand between Rivalon and the dark power that threatens to destroy it. Wherever source appears, hunters follow. Now just, just, just to be sure, our uh, dedicated viewing audience will be able to hear the incredibly dramatic narration. Oh yes. All right, good. Now good. here's my, my the thing that that makes it like like the 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 inane cleverness of s making it sorcerers. Rise and shine. It could have just as easily been the wizards. Wants you up on the there. power of whiz, with what, what evil really spellcasters taking sad? whizzes all over the land. Don't ever you're going yeah, there. The, the thing that makes me kind of sad about the sorcerers thing is that, is that I've written a fantasy novel, and I use that same ploy. Uh, I, I think there's probably a thousand yeah. um, amateur fantasy authors that have done the same thing. I could think of a couple of professional fantasy authors that have done that. We're also talking about sailors. We've reached Sicyon, but there's trouble offshore, so we'll have to sail in carefully. Here, have a look. Those are orc ships, and they're blocking our passage. We'll get you as close to the city as we can, and drop you off on the beach. Be wary now. My eye Orcs patch is really convenient for looking through this telescope. Undead have closed every route out, and I'm I'm honestly impressed at how good the lip syncing the they counselor. managed to get with just photo it. manipulation. May like this is just three layers of a picture in Photoshop that someone's really carefully uh, stretched. Yeah, I mean people work really hard on this game. Divinity Reserve Original Sin. Yeah, the Original Sin part. No, that's that's. Uh, Turns out, some, really some lawyer happen. somewhere is like, so guys, I got some good news and I got some bad news. We got the trademark on Divinity, but it turns out that the Vatican had already <laughs> trademarked Original Sin. Original Sin. We missed that one. We j we missed it by like, just like three thousand years. Um, yeah, it turns out it's in the Pentateuch, and there's a whole thing, but on the upside, uh, we, uh, we learned some stuff today, and, uh, we can go back to workshopping that whole Source of Magic, uh, name. Right. Awesome. Uh, you might want to heal yourself a little bit, because, uh, while you were putzing around, I set you on fire. 
That's our intro. <laughs> You're a jerk. But we have game footage, and we're running around on a beach. On a beach. Everything is fine. Although I've, ju I've just noticed that my staff is constantly sparking. Yeah. I feel like this is probably a safety hazard. Yeah, Although well, the, the static uh, electricity might explain my hairdo. Well, then, look, it's important. Remind me, I'm just healing myself from that time that you set me on fire. Remember that? That was uh, that was a good time. I should do that again. You're a monster. I could I could also drop you from the sky if you'd like to be somewhere else. I wonder if I can do that. Can I drop you from the sky? I could totally drop you from the sky. Do it. I want to try. I want to. At least the orcs make a better noise when they attack. I only took twelve damage. Strike with neither warning nor mercy. That seems actually kind of useful. We might want to try that in a fight. Instead of you teleporting an enemy over to me, you could teleport me over to an enemy. I I am picking up uh, seashells. Oh man, they're everywhere. Oh, they are. Seashell game too strong. I'm trying to remember how the controls work. There's what? There is there is a creepy voice, like there's an old man's voice. What? Do you not hear the old man voice? No, I don't. I think it's just in your head. It was creepy. Uh huh. It, it is in my head because I've got earphones in my head. But tell me more about the creepy old man voice. It was a creepy old man voice mumbling about yield me under the water. What's it doing here alone? Oh, there's a corpse. Uh, with a scroll. I'll take that. He's not using it. That seems legit. I mean, you seem like the kind of person who would just take stuff off a dead person. It was beside him. It's not like I'm gonna... Well, I'm gonna oh, it was him beside him. He dropped it in his final moments, I guess. I guess he's not... You know, it's not really his anymore. Okay, now I've looted the corpse. I mean, but he had a journal. I wasn't I mean, even a around private, when you did A private that. diary. All right, dude, let's read his diary. All right, I'm going to read his private diary. Uh, Junar 21st. Uh, rejoice, for the statues have granted my wish. Their whimsical nature, however, must not be taken lightly. So before I soar through the sky like an eagle... I shall attempt a mere hop from the cliffs down at the beach. This should be a small feat for the man that can fly. If this experiment is successful, the sun shall be my next target. Oh dear. I... So, uh, yeah. Ooh, a cooperative dialogue. Doublet mask. Uh, yes, I. All great deeds require the occasional leap of faith. I'm so faithful, I live on nothing but snow and crickets. Uh, at the end of a stiff tangle of limbs on a forgotten beach, I prefer a measured step to a flailing leap, thanks. I'm... Although, I, I think this guy was pretty much doomed, because, like, even if he had found out that he could fly, um, he would have then aimed for the sun. <laughs> that is a terrible plan. It, yeah. It's like, oh, jumping off this cliff didn't kill me. Clearly I can travel to a star. A giant burning fusion ball in the sky. Well, maybe that's not. Maybe the sun's something different here. Yeah, I mean, the sun is probably made of source. Yeah, or, or like, it, it is the... Fight! Oh. Upon them, source hunters. Secure source the stone. hunters. I'll deal with these rats. Goddess, be with you, master. You guys are religious. I'm religious too. We have something in common. Rise, arise, drawn forth from blood. I bid you aid. Okay, we don't do that in my religion. The whole blood magic, undead zombie thing. Uh, though. Uh, the, I don't see why not. It seems very effective. I I think I'm more orthodox, and these these guys are like, I don't know, um, reformed. No, uh, it's. Yeah, that totally seems like, like, what more of a, like, like, you know, Pentecostal revivalist sort of thing. Yeah. 
Range is 15 meters. How far are you from me? You're only 8 meters from me. Ha! Are you encouraged now? Uh, no. Really? <laughs> Do you have to target me? Is it just a... Ha! You're encouraged. I'm not encouraged. Duh, at least I encourage myself. All right. Strength, dexterity, and intelligence plus one. That seems legit. I guess I'll move up here so I can tank these guys. All right. Um. I recommend blowing something up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop this guy in your head. Why don't you drop him on someone else's head? I don't know, but that was funny. That was pretty funny. I, I don't see why I would ever do anything else in this game. Other hey, Booney, there's really. <laughs> Like, what do you do? I hit things with swords. That's awesome. I drop things from the sky. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm gonna finish my little turn. Ow. Oh, I missed. Oh, you want some of this? Bam! Uh, you should be more on fire. I like that you lob it over my head. I and I mean that. I appreciate it. You got nothing. You a scrub. Their leader said something about escaping with Money. a stone. Stolen from this dungeon, I imagine. Could we get inside? My dexterity is not high enough for this armor. Ah, clearly. You are not meant for it. What is my dexterity? Uh, mine is five. I suspect that is not high enough either. Aged leather armor requires six. Yeah, probably meant for rogues. I, I prefer something more comfy and pajama-like. I prefer the feeling of plate mail against my bare skin. Which is why you do not wear pants. You got it. Also because my skin is naturally hardened by a diet of crickets and snow. <laughs> Bam! Yoink! Ah! Oh! Injad. Oh, 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 is that how it's gonna be? <laughs> Hello, I, I feel like you have a subtle advantage in this fight that you control the healing. I do. And with that, you're just gonna walk away. My heal is still cooling down. Oh, so is my teleport. Let's not get in a fight. Okay. Let's let's not fight anymore. All right. How does this work? You grab it, and then you, oh yeah. I just lift things with the power of my cricket diet. Your faith can move mountains in moderate-sized barrels. Yes, well, some people are more faithful than others. Careful. Someone must have an interest in protecting whatever's kept here. With a single, easily spotted explosive device. Yeah, I mean, you... What, what do you Boom! Got? Nicely done. I, I do like the fact that somebody has clearly gone, oh, this old ancient tomb, uh, holding some dead king or something. Eh, it seems a reasonable place to do a lot of storage. I was going to keep my empty barrels in it. Yeah. A king's tomb, is it? I've always heard there was more to these than meets the eye. Judging from the reverb on my voice, this place is gigantic.
Ooh, ooh, I got a mushroom. Oh, it's gonna be one of those games, is it? <laughs> Where you uh, pick up every you got you got a mushroom of... out of this broken pot? Yeah, this this ancient king's tomb. Actually, it's it's got to be really well maintained because these candles are everywhere, and they're like maybe half burnt down. Yeah, somebody's gotta come and replace these. Like, yeah, this is. Somebody I like how blithely we just split the party. Yeah, I found a rat. I, I found a chest. I also found some lock picks. Oh yeah, I guess splitting the party is probably a, you, they have no idea what I'm doing if I don't follow you around. Huh. I'm not used to playing with other humans. I picked up some lock picks. I am figuring out how to use lock picks. I'm smashing uh, here. Uh, I'll, I'll I'll help you out. There we go. Uh, uh, uh. Unlocked. Yay. Arrows. That seems useful. What yeah, is my you... weapon of choice right now, anyway? It's a bat. <laughs> just, just got a bat. Yeah, are you specialized in anything, or like... like... What level of specialization goes into this? Are you one-handed? Are you specifically a bat user? Um, I think the level of specialization is just in one-handed. Hey! I oh, found oh, a thing. Oh. Oh. Don't get left behind. Ooh. We made short work of that door. But I don't imagine our weapons would survive such use for long. Yeah, well, I don't believe that the, the designers of this game anticipated my smashing bat. We should probably save. Uh, that sounds like a sound decision. I am the lord of saving, which means I will be obsessively quick saving the whole time. Oh, 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 that's a lot of fire. A lot of fire. Don't step in the fire. No, thank you, tutorial message, for keeping me from uh, being able to do anything. Okay. Uh, I have a ranged attack. Good, because I don't. That doesn't break a barrel in one shot. You are a wussy. You know what would fix you? Some good snow and crickets. An old-fashioned meal. It's hearty. It's good for what ails ya. You, I, I have heard of your order, and you are in fact not. Uh, oh, Ow. well done. I did. I disarmed the shit out of that. Barbarian-style disarming. Look, all right. My skin is hardened hey, look, again. Hey, look, what's sitting right there? A trap disarm toolkit. Sorry, I couldn't I'll, hear I'll you. Just, over I'll just all take that. that. Shut up. Um. Anyway, Clearly open. You can't be trusted with it. Open this chest. I, I didn't say lock picks. It's a trap disarm toolkit. No, because I I don't have an extra smashing device for this chest. All right. Well, I'm gonna clear some fire because I'm gonna assume that there's lock picks around. That seems reasonable. Yep. Yep. Found some. All right, let's go check out that chest. Um, there's still fire in the way, so it'll be a bit. Did you just electrify all that water? Oh, yeah, I guess that, that would happen. Oh, dear. Oh, I'm, I don't want to stand there. I think you stunned me. Yeah, I am. I'm stunned. <laughs> Shit. There we go. I finally blew up. Okay. Um, can't can't talk. Stunned. So you'll be fine in a minute. Uh. Jesus, you're the fucking worst. Just give me a second. Give me. A second. I can fix it. I can fix it.
I'm just, I'm just encouraging you now. Did you just throw a fireball at a water barrel? Well, I think, I think I can dry out this water with fire. Uh, nope. Now I'm just lighting the ground on fire. So the um, new, new solution. Uh, could you come a little closer? Yeah, yeah, no problem. I think I see what's going on here. How's that? Uh, yeah, just, just, just a little bit closer. Uh, are, are you stuck on that side of the? Uh... No, there. Oh, no, yeah. no. I'm stuck. Oh, there it's gone. It's gone. Oh, oh, uh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that right, was impeccable gonna... timing. All right, I got the lock picks. Awesome. Uh, I'll go unlock the chest. Will you, uh, you eat some crickets? Crickets are delicious. I just gotta, like, load some cricket carbs or something. Please tell me there's something good in that chest. Oh, I'm sure. Yeah, tutorial equipment's always the best. Uh, there's a head vice scroll. Is that the blow-up head one? No, it just sort of sometimes makes people blind and gives them a headache. Boring. Yeah, it, it's basically the migraine spell. Which, I mean, that, that sucks. Migraines are really unpleasant. Uh, I feel like sword is a more effective uh, spell, though. No, look, if I, if I want to give somebody a headache, I have a bat. I yeah, will give I those some like bitches world, a headache. Like... Well, maybe maybe we don't want to kill everybody. Maybe we're just like I don't I under dislike you a lot. I understand. The, like I understand that there are words coming out of your mouth, but I don't look. I only kill people who are evil. Now I understand that as a former wizard Nazi, this is uh, this is foreign to you, but um, I will tell you that there are a lot of evil people in the world. Ooh, fireball scroll. Oh, there's a thing to explode. God, come I am on up here. backing up. <laughs> I'm cool. I'm cool here. Bam! Ooh. You found a key? I found a key. Well, we it will was see, in the chest. We will see what it does in the next episode. How's that sound? That sounds good. Wait, goodbye. Bye-bye. <laughs> and I will be Straight out, baby.